on. It's me, your mermaid. Girl. Hi, today I'm going to be exposing my real identity as a fantasy fiction mermaid. I don't think blue of any sort suits me. I don't think it's the right for my skin tone or anything. But today I have a very special reason for going for this. Today I'm going to be kind of be bringing back or like recreating or like whatever a Stella versus Instagram. Usually I do it via Pinterest, but someone sent me a picture on Instagram and I'm going to be recreating it today. A while back somebody kind of sent me this picture and I fell in love with it. I thought the first thing that struck me was the color. I think that was like that color is insane, but I have a feeling it might be a wig. And then obviously there's the whole braided, ribboned, decorated, like kind of hairstyle aspect that like absolutely caught my eye and that is why I think like it's such an amazingly intricate, gorgeous hairstyle. And I was like, fine, one day in my life, I'm gonna try it out. But I'm like, I don't have that color on my hair, duh. And I don't have a wig that is bright enough. But then weekend wigs <laughs> reached out to me and they're like, hello. Do you want to work with us? And I'm like, let me see what you got. And I saw this wig and I'm like, oh my God, bless. So I got the wig from their website, but this is the wig. This is the color. I did not touch it. Obviously it's synthetic, but I saw it. I put it on, I glued it on. I did my makeup and I'm like, oh my God, I'm ready. I'm going to be styling my brand new synthetic weekend wigs teal hair to kind of match the hairstyle from Instagram. Link of this wig is going to be down in the description box below. As I said, weekend wigs. Let's get into the hair styling aspect of the video. The braid itself, I don't actually know what it is. It looks like a Dutch braid. Unfortunately, do not really know what it is. So I'm going to do what I know how to do, which is a Dutch braid. And I have this necklace that I think would look really cute um, in the center. So it would be kind of like at the back. Oh my god, even like this, it looks so cute. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I definitely want a fringe type thing. And my parting is really far on the side. I'm not sure how I feel about that. I might just... Um, mm, mm -hmm. Yeah, that looks better. I hate it. It looks ugly. Ugly. I think this looks cute. Picking up hair when you've got wefts underneath is really not that easy. Um, I'm gonna repeat the, all of this on this side. <laughs> Smooth sailing from here, I hope. <laughs> The trick with synthetic hair is you have to be a bit savage with this, otherwise, honestly, you're not gonna get anywhere. Okay, so now it's time for the bow. I'm not exactly sure how I'm going to do that yet, so... I'm gonna try something. It might be stupid. I want to go for mini bows. Yeah. Okay, now we need one. Like that. Okay, so I'll mix it up. Oh, 
it's kind of a bow. This look was a bit stressful, but I put a significant amount of effort into it. The look is complete! Oh my god, oh my god, okay. <clears throat> it's a bit tedious, so honestly I'd much rather you rec I recommend you do it either on the wig prior to putting it on or else on someone else. So I'm really happy with it. The color, oh my god, I'm still not over like the color. I think it looks so amazing, so good, so fun genuinely encouraging you to try it out i'm gonna leave the link of this beautiful wig down description box below please check it out especially if you are interested in getting kind of like a more bright you know kind of a color but not like comic-y everything was from weekend wigs um so i'll link them down below as well as any coupon code that i might have cool i'm gonna go now um i do hope you enjoyed this video i hope you'll give it a go and i will see you in my next video